What are you working on? It's a computer terminal that hooks up to the TV, and in theory, it'll display whatever you're working on. Uh, Steve? Wow. Stories of great men is always about what brings them to their moment of enlightenment. And this is an epic about Steve Jobs. Welcome to Apple Computer. You expecting something else? Yeah, maybe something a little less Manson family. Trust me, on my I N T E. And set. And background. Action. When I first met Ashton, he already on some level walked in as Steve. My name is Steve Jobs. When I founded this company, I had one goal in mind to put the power of the world's most advanced technology in the hands and homes of people just like you and me. We clearly knew that this was the man who should play it. Jesus. No, nope. it's just Steve. Nobody really knows what he's capable of until I think they see his performance in this movie because you look up and you think you're seeing the man. You think you're hearing this person. It is now 1984. Apple is perceived to be the only hope to give IBM a run for its money. Josh and I hit it off right off the bat. We talked about all the places life was being affected by this guy and the story that we wanted to tell. We got to make the small things unforgettable. Typeface isn't a pressing issue. Get out. Ashton's crushing it in this part. It's so fun to watch. Are you good? Are you creative? I, I think so. Welcome to the Macintosh team. He's amazing. He truly is committed emotionally to the core. It's not about posing. It's about finding the heart of the character. And you're either with me or you're against me. Are you with me, boy? There are some people that are extremely unique to the world. And we all have the same passion to tell a story that really honors this man and that experience. In life, you only get to do so many things. So make it great. Plus, you gotta figure out what to do with all these employees. It's gonna be so cool. He's just a kid. Steve, you're just a kid.